WhatsApp GB, WhatsApp Gold, WhatsApp Prime, WhatsApp Plus, there are many of these applications which exist right now. And recently I've started seeing many people using modern WhatsApp applications like these to gain access to certain features like chat lock, custom themes, so on and so forth, which is not there in the original WhatsApp. Having these features can be eye candy, but is it a good idea to install this modern version of WhatsApp and ruin your life with it? I know you guys might be confused, but watch this video till the end because I'm going to tell you the outcomes if you use modern WhatsApp apps. So, hey guys, welcome back. I'm your host Arnav and you are watching Tech Arena. So let's go. All right, so I've already made a video on installing modded applications and what are the outcomes if you install modded apps. Check that video. The link will be in the description and in the cards above. First, let me clearly differentiate between modded WhatsApp and the original WhatsApp. So the original WhatsApp is made by Meta and is owned by Meta. It has many privacy policy guidelines and many other norms. It has chat support and all those stuff. It is published and developed by WhatsApp Inc. So this is an application which is free to use it's a chatting application as you all know and has a big company backing it so if there is any small issue which comes it will be a very big news but whereas a modded whatsapp is actually a modded version of the original whatsapp which is tweaked and adjusted by a third party developer whom we clearly don't know and there won't be any proper policy guidelines there won't be anything which governs that particular application and data hijacking can be easy by installing a whatsapp modded version let me explain some of the security threats that you might face while using modded whatsapp which is whatsapp gold whatsapp prime or whatever modded whatsapp it may be first and foremost thing is privacy policy and guidelines now the original whatsapp has a long privacy policy guidelines which whatsapp will not violate and you should read and agree upon so these companies whether it's instagram facebook or any other social media application for that matter will have a long privacy policy guidelines which they will not violate they will follow strictly now whereas the modern version of whatsapp application will never have any privacy policy and even if it has then there's no necessary for that particular third party developer to follow all these privacy guidelines and not to violate it because these applications are not even there on play store which is again a very big threat so Keep in mind that privacy policy and all other guidelines will only be there for official applications that you download through Play Store and not for these kind of modded applications. So that's the first and foremost thing that you should take a look at having privacy policy. And there's no need of the third party developer who tweak the modded version of WhatsApp to follow all the privacy guidelines because I mean, they can do anything with your data and moreover, if you have anything very fragile in terms of the data that you have on your WhatsApp, then there are a lot of chances that your data might get leaked through them. Second thing is end-to-end -end encryption. Now, the original WhatsApp has end-to-end -end encryption, which means that the chat between you and another person is end-to-end -end encrypted with a changing code. And even WhatsApp can't access that particular chat according to them. But Whereas these modern applications, they claim to have end-to-end -end encryption, but really they might not have. So this results in having your chat read by the developer who tweaked the particular WhatsApp application. So end-to-end -end encryption is a very important thing because even WhatsApp can't access your chat. But whereas if you install a modern version of WhatsApp like WhatsApp GB or WhatsApp Plus, there are a lot of chances of your chats getting exposed to that particular developer. And as I said, if you're sharing any fragile information with your friend or any other contact, then there are a lot of possibilities that the developer or the manager of that particular application can get an access to your chat. The third thing is customer support. Now, the official WhatsApp has an official customer support page in their website as well as in their application. But whereas this modern version of WhatsApp doesn't have any customer support. And if you try to mail the official WhatsApp application, they will quickly respond to you from the customer support team. But whereas even if you have a customer support on the so-called GB or WhatsApp Gold, you will not simply get a response. You can try it yourselves. And keep in mind that while you try, you're trying it on your own risk. So yes, customer support is not there in any of this modern WhatsApp application, which makes it difficult even if you face any issues while using that particular application. So always install the original WhatsApp. Number four is Google Play Protect. Now, whatever applications that you download through Google Play Store will have Google Play Protect protection. 
So this is kind of an antivirus for all these applications which lets all these applications not to you know violate any privacy norms or something like that. So whatever application that is there on the Play Store might have passed many basic tests of Google in order to qualify to be on the Play Store and that's why many applications like the WhatsApp Web or WhatsApp GB, WhatsApp Gold, or WhatsApp Prime or whatever these modern applications won't be there on Play Store and yes that is the first and foremost threat that you need to analyze before downloading any modded app whether it's there on play store or not modded apps are not safe that's common for any modded app whether it's true color or whatsapp or anything even if you download a version of modded app that's officially there on play store it's dangerous and it won't get any google play protect because google play protect ensures that the app is not taking or hijacking any of your data so the last and final threat your number will be banned if you use a modern version of WhatsApp. Now, this is a very, very happening thing right now because I've seen my friend's number being blocked by WhatsApp permanently just because he had used a modern version of app. Despite me saying him continuously not to use any modern version of WhatsApp, he started using it and finally ended up getting his number banned permanently and not being able to use WhatsApp permanently. In that number which he had, his WhatsApp, his chats, his media, everything was gone in just a single click. Now these are only some points to prove that you shouldn't use any modern version of WhatsApp and Yes, there are many eye candy features like custom chat logs and custom themes and all those stuff. WhatsApp is a very private application and you might have used that application to chat privately with your girlfriend or with your wife or someone that you're close to. And if you end up getting your chat being public, then that is a problem. So never ever use any modern version of apps like WhatsApp GB, WhatsApp Silver, Gold or Platinum or whatever the name of that application is. So keep in mind, never ever use modern version of WhatsApp. So yes, I'm sure this video was very useful and share this video with all of your friends because it can help them save their privacy. So if you have enjoyed watching my content, a like to this video would be absolutely great. And hey, don't forget to subscribe because it's very simple. Red color subscribe button, make it gray. And also press the bell icon and turn the notifications to all to get all the notifications whenever I post any new video. So this is me, Anav, signing off. Talk to you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.